Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. Before I go into this video, I would like to make a shout out to Futuristic Innovation. Futuristic Innovation was the first to say, Hey, you squared, can you do um, a quick shout out for me? So, so Futuristic Innovations, here is your shout out. Congratulations, brother. So in this video, I want to show you how to bind the drone with the controller. So how to connect them together to, to get it working. So right now I'm trying to plug in the, the battery. So this is a quick setup so you guys can watch this video if you want to know how to get this drone um, flying. So now um, when you connect the when you put on the drone, you power on the controller. So after that you make sure the um, the control the drone is set on the flat surface ground. Because if you try to lift the drone up, it won't bind. So you have to put it on the flat surface. Uh, you have to put it down. Then after putting, it, putting the drone down, uh, it will change the color. The flashing blue and white will change to red when you put it down. And also right now, it's flashing red, which indicates it's ready to bind. So. You press the left joystick up and down so it binds to the controller. So the flashing indicates it's ready to bind actually. Turning the left stick to 11 o'clock and the right joystick to 1 o'clock all together so um, it sets the gyroscope. So if you guys want to know how to do that, so by pressing those two buttons um, together at the same time, calibrates the gyroscope. So yeah, so that's how it is now. I'm going to wait for the, sig the GPS signal. I'm using a one key takeoff, so that's the key. So it's yeah. pressed now, so the drone is going up by itself to about 10 meters. So then it is stop. So that's auto takeoff and auto landing key. <laughs> Changing the speed from speed 1 to speed 2 and with the push of the button press and holding the by pressing and holding the camera button activates the video the video mode of this drone so that was shown there right now I, I am going to do a short flight um, and then to take some aerial shots so kill the music I'll be right back The S Series S20W GPS it's a 2.4 GHz FPV real time um, video and image transmission quadcopter. So, and um, the quick features it has is a, is a GPS drone. So, obviously, it's going to have um, obviously it's going to have it's going to have a return to home function and um, a low battery return. So that is when the battery is low, it's um, it's comes back to where to come from then has a follow me mode then it's range up to 300 meters using the 2.4 gigahertz technology and height of up to 120 meters and it has a max maximum speed of um, up to 25 kilometers per hour and um, the camera is an HD Wi-Fi camera 75 degree articulating 120 degree wide angle lens so yeah and then you can use your SD card as an um, optional. So this drone, this drone doesn't have a, a gimbal. Um, uh, it doesn't have a camera gimbal to stabilize the, um, the footage. So, and also the battery capacity is a uh, 3.7 volt, 1000 mAh battery that provides uh, a more flight flight time of about eight to ten minutes. Yeah, eight to ten minutes. Okay. So this um, drone is a great. This drone is a great flyer. I really love it. So um, it's a dual GPS positioning. It has an auto hover function, headless mode. It has a camera, 720p or 1080p camera, and uh, it's app enabled. And, and of course, um, the weather is a little bit. Um, it's not too windy. So and 
I can really get a, a beautiful shot because this drone doesn't have uh, a gimbal, doesn't have a gimbal. Okay, um, that's it, get us how to get the drone going, that's how to connect, how to bind the drone with the controller and then to calibrate the gyroscope. So yeah, so that's what this um, this video is all about. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.